Hello, my name is Dale Wilhite. I live in Mountain Village, Colorado. Uh, if you want to find anything about me, you can go to MySpace where I have a page. This here deals with timeouts. It's a concept of mine that's a couple years old, uh, which if enacted by the NFL or the NAACP or NCAA, it would uh, make it possible for coaches to call a timeout faster and could possibly save uh, a team from losing a game because they weren't able to call a timeout in time. A lot of times, we, if you watch football as much as I do, you, you see a lot of coaches trying to get get the doing this, trying to get the referee's attention that I, we want a timeout. Uh, and sometimes they lose the game because they're not able to get that timeout, but the referee didn't see it. And then there's times when uh, ball players will call a timeout like the captain on the football team and he's not supposed to, and they lose their timeout and end up losing the game because of it. You know, it, it's, it's, it's not really, it, this is not necessary. I'm surprised that the NFL and the uh, NCAA uh, have not yet figured out uh, how to make calling timeout a little bit more expedient and a little bit more fair in a way that uh, uh, would be would lead to less controversies and less problems. Uh, I've, I've learned things in life that some people make things harder than they have to be. Simply put, my idea is this: that coaches need to have a buzzer, something on the side on their to wear on their belt or maybe in their hand. I don't know that makes it possible for them to call those three timeouts or to call a uh, challenge, you know. And when they make that timeout, it appears on the scoreboard. And it's so loud that everybody in the stadium hears it. There's no doubt about it. You can't, no matter how loud the crowd is, when that buzzer goes off, everyone in the stadium is going to hear it. They can be screaming top of the lungs. They're going to hear it. I mean, you don't want it too loud, but loud enough where everybody hears it. That way, these Referees can't say, well, we didn't hear it, we didn't see it, we didn't know about it. And this is one way that these coaches can get the timeouts that they need when they need them. And when they make that, when that buzzer goes off and it appears on the scoreboard, right beside it will be a time that shows you the time, uh, what time it was to the, to the second that they call timeout. Because a lot of times timeouts are called because the uh, team uh, spent too much time uh, in the huddle. Uh, or on the sideline and getting, uh, and are, they're not going to be able to get their playoff. So sometimes the coach needs to call a timeout with maybe one second to go before the uh, play clock uh, expires, you know, or the 30 second or 40 second uh, play clock. Uh, actually, I believe it's a 40 second play clock. But anyhow, that's how it can be done, and this would make this would make it a lot more simple, uh, cost a little bit more to enact it, you know, put everything in place. But it makes it possible for uh, uh, to pretty much put an end to all these controversies about calling timeout, and these coaches don't have to run out on the field trying to do this and, and stupid things like that. I mean, it's not necessary, and it's important to know when that timeout is called is to the last second. Every second counts in a ball game, especially when it's close, and it can mean the difference between a winning season and a losing season, and a winning game and a losing a game. And it's just too important, and I'm just baffled as to why the NFL and the NCAA have not yet enacted something like this, or, or I wonder if they even thought of it. So if you like my idea, write the NCAA, write the NFL, and tell them to take this concept and run with it and make it a reality. So that football games are just a little bit more fair, a little bit more honest, and uh, because it may be your team or my team that loses because of this. I've seen my teams lose before because the coach wasn't able to get the referee's attention to call timeout. So it just makes the game a little bit more fair, a little bit better, and a little bit more interesting. And that's the way um, we could this problem with calling uh, timeouts could be solved. Thank you for your time.